Today I am exploring Tishomingo State Park. Let's go check it out. If you pull up Tishomingo State Park, this is probably the first thing you see is a swinging bridge. It says it was constructed in 1939. Let's see how sturdy it is. Well, it's sure swinging. Okay, it's bouncing, it's bouncing, it's bouncing. Feels pretty sturdy to me. It just got wood boards on it. How thick they are. Them boards are only two inches thick, it feels like. Maybe three inches. Check this out. That's very pretty. Pretty sure you could canoe down this river. I'm not big on canoeing. If you ever get wet and you sit back in the canoe, does your butt start itching? Well, maybe that's just me. I don't know. But it's fine as long as you don't get wet. It's April the 4th right now, and maybe a little chilly for canoeing, but give it another month. Be ready. Looks like they have a little walkway here. I'm assuming this is where you can launch your canoes out. See? They got some nice little steps for you right here. Like you can drive down and just make your loop straight out. I don't know where they pick you up at. I'm assuming there's another spot down the river you can take out at. I would think. Never know, you may have to paddle back up the river. I don't know. May want to have a plan before you launch the kayak. Looks like we have a little pavilion here. Looks like we have a volleyball court. I suck at volleyball. Looks like we need a new net. Hey, I guess you could play on it. Maybe a little tough on the other side, but hey, make it a little more interesting. It would be like parkour volleyball. Have to jump over the mound. We have a drink machine. It's always handy. Looks like they have a swimming pool. I don't think it's going to be in operation this year. I used to have a swimming pool. It's a lot of work keeping them up. And that, that's a huge swimming pool. Probably costs a lot to keep that sucker going. I think this park is understaffed right now, which it's like that with everybody, but if you need a job, I think this park is hiring. Let's go check out some trails. Hey, if you're going rock climbing, you must have a helmet and a permit. I didn't know they had rock climbing. Hey, rock climbing is a lot harder than you think. I've tried that before. Indoor rock climbing. Okay, there wasn't anybody at the gate when we came in. It was like an honor system. And there's no map for the trail, so let's just see where it goes. Maybe there's no bears out here. Got my handy dandy razor blade I always carry with me. You know, they say if you see a bear, you're supposed to just, you know, make make yourself big or, like, play dead. Not this guy. If I see a bear, I am going to try to outrun it. I'll run and jump in that river. I'll do. They call me Usain Bolt after that. Well, the trails are good and maintained, looks like. Got a tree here, but it's kind of out of the way. I came here about eight years ago. I had it in my mind I was going to run all these trails here. Did not happen. I got about halfway through. Not the best trails if you want to run. Hiking, yes, but running, not so much. Roots everywhere. Good way to break ankle. Got a little brook here. Pretty. Oh, this is nice. Whoa! Whoa! That, that fell. Check this out. That is pretty. Man, if you had a hammock right here, you could sleep for days. Alright, let's see where else we can go. The water is high right now, but during the summer, 
the water here can get really low, especially if we don't have any rain. So you may want to check that before you come canoeing here. My son came here a couple years ago and went canoeing. He said they had to drag the canoe a lot because the water was so low. Doesn't sound very fun, but it's high right now. It's just perfect. Hey, there's a boulder. There's a nice boulder. Wonder where the rock climbing's at. Go check it out. I have a little water fountain here. I don't know if I'd want to drink out of that. Get nice steps. Pre-made steps. That's what I like. Just need an escalator now. All right, let's go uphill. Hey, if I stay on the trail, it's got to lead me somewhere. Check this out. I don't know about climbing that. Whew. I'm not Tom Cruise, okay? Pretty neat. This would be a good spot to camp if it was a little flatter. You could put a hammock between these rocks. Oh, yeah. Whew. I think this trailer here will lead me back to the beginning. Whew. There's a little little hill right there I had to climb. Whew, all right. It's a little spot. Looks like they used to have a fire in there. It's got a pretty little waterfall. Got a little creek here. Or a brook. That's what we call it, a brook. Branch, whatever. Uphill. Why do they always got to go uphill? I can't ever find a trail that goes down here. Now that is a drop off. You don't want to fall off this. Nope. This is a state park. You can't hunt here, but this would be a really good like deer stand. <laughs> you just put your chair right here and you can see everything. Very illegal. Do not do that. But if you had another piece of land that had kind of a, a drop off like that, be perfect. I don't even deer hunt, but I like looking at deer. I like eating deer. Just don't, cannot get into hunting. Watch, we see a big deer now. <laughs> see the biggest deer in the world. Hey, I get it on camera. It's got a nice clear path. Okay, how long is this trail? God, I feel like I've been walking for hours. It's like April the 4th. This is a perfect time to come to a state park. If you ain't never been to Mississippi, if you come in the summertime, woo, the humidity will get you, man. You're in July and August, man. I would not want to be doing this. I'd be wanting to find a lake. Be jumping in that creek. All right, I hear a waterfall or something. This must be the expert trail. Whew, we got some downhill, but it's steep downhill. Oh, yeah, I see a waterfall. Peaceful waterfall. I wish I had one of these in my backyard. Check that out. That's pretty. You could lay down and take a nap right here. Whew. I'm going to dunk my head under that. <laughs> All right, we got a fork in the road. I'm going to go this way. Go to the right. Hey, the trails look good. It's not too bad. I wish I had a map. Very peaceful back here. I like walking in the woods. I'm trying to get back to the bridge. We have a disc golf course here. I was going to go check that out. Oh, they say making YouTube videos is easy. Whew. Do you have to go hike five miles? I'm doing this for you guys. Let you see what you're missing here. I see the bridge. I have made it. Whew. I did that with no maps. Ha! I've got a good sense of direction. Yeah. Made it back to the bridge. Whew. Well, that was a fun trail. I have a lot more trails. 
think they're on the other side or like around the uh, disc golf area. But they're marked throughout the park. Got my workout in this morning. All right. Let's go try to find this disc golf thing. Hey, they got disc golf. Let's see if I can get a hole in one. <laughs> oh, no. I suck. They have these family cabins that you can rent. You can get on their website and check out the rates. I'm not exactly sure how much they charge or not, but I don't think it's too much. They got these little pavilions that you can uh, have get together that. Pretty nice. This is pavilion number one. Looks like they have another hiking trail down this way. Hey, I like these benches. Those are pretty nice. Yeah, this would be nice just to have a little get together or a family reunion or birthday party or something like that. Put your fire in there. The first bathroom I went to was locked. And I checked this. They have a bathroom right beside here. And it was unlocked. And it was pretty clean, so... At least we have one restroom to use. May have to pee in the woods. Tell you what, just to drive in here is worth it because really pretty. Be really pretty on a motorcycle. Check out this trail. Stairs. It's always stairs. Let's go check out this old house down here. This is pretty. Looks like we have an old cabin. A little walkway. That bridge. It's a pretty bridge. They don't build stuff like that anymore. Pretty cool. Oh, cabin. Look at this. Look how it's on them uh, rocks. <laughs> you want to build your house on rocks? I don't know about that. Check out the inside. Got it boarded up here. They got an old fireplace and hey what? We're spoiled. <laughs> Imagine living in that. Looks like they have another trail beside this cabin. This is a whale house. Whale house. What the heck is a whale house? house where you keep your well in, I guess. Go get you some water. So we have a pretty big waterfall type thing up here. Let's go check it out. Pretty. It's like a dam. Check that out. That's pretty. You build you one of them in your backyard. Oh, it's always uphill. Uh-oh. Man. Check this out. I bet there's some frogs in there. Need a little boat and go frog gigging. Very pretty. Wonder if there's any fish in there. I know they got a big lake that we're gonna go to. Says you can fish there. Let's go check it out. They got a lake and a big campground. Let's go see what that's about. If you come to this cabin area, looks like there's a trail this way and on up the hill there. Plenty of hiking. Whew. See what is perfect day to be hiking. It's like 65 degrees. Perfect. They got a massive lake here. I bet you there's some good bass in it. Check this out. It's a big old lake. I think they got these tents right here that you can also rent. You got your chairs and a fire pit out there. It's all you need. You can grill you some hamburgers over the fire pit. They have a big campground over here. 
We'll go check it out. They have a nice dock out here you can come fishing on. A little windy today, but this it's a long dock. Campground is on the other side of the lake. It pretty much goes all the way around right here. I'm assuming there's, you know, brown, probably some catfish and bass in this lake. Should have brought my fishing pole. Hey, where's the fish at? Hey, what I'm doing is I'm going to go to every state park in Mississippi. Then I'm going to make a video where I rank each park. So, off to a good start. I like this park. They have a really nice campground. Look at this spot. Surprised there's nobody sitting right here camping. This is where I'd want to be. Perfect. There's already a bunch of people here. Probably close to half full, I would say. Get you a kayak and get in this lake. Get pretty. Well, I would recommend you coming here. It's very nice. And thank you for watching and subscribing. We'll catch you at the next part.